information is power, but if it is hidden amongst a mass of unstructured files, that's the definition of big data, which may be tucked away in the cloud, how on earth can you take advantage? Object-based storage could be the key to unlocking big data and effective cloud computing. So what is it? First, let's look at traditional storage. At the lowest level, data is made up of ones and zeros. Hard drives store these in chunks called blocks. An operating system, like Microsoft Windows or Linux, can combine blocks together to create files. The operating system has no understanding of the nature of the files or what is in them. This is left to the applications, but they only understand specific file types. To make it easier for applications and users to locate files, they are stored within a file system. The exact root and branch location for each file is determined by each application or user. Object stores enable information about each file to be stored with the file, thus creating what is called an object. This is called metadata and tends to be in the form of text and numbers, which can be read outside of the originating application. It's like iTunes or Windows Media Player. To access music, you simply look for artist, album title, etc. A key field within the metadata is the hash checksum. This is a stamp of validity for the object. Unlike any other type of storage device like SAN or NAS, object stores know if an object is changed, corrupted or deleted based on the hash checksum. The data carries its own integrity. The system can be set to keep, say, two copies of each object. Now, lost objects can be regenerated. The system is self-healing. Objects don't sit in a root and branch file system. They sit within a flat container. Object stores are highly scalable using a scale-out architecture. Once the capacity of a node is approached, another can be deployed, and another, and so on. For resilience, we can put nodes into different sites. We can determine that our object copies appear in both sites, and now the data is protected against corruption, deletion, and a major disaster on one of the sites. In this scenario, we may claim that the data does not need backing up to tape. The benefits of object storage are enormous. A flat storage scheme can cater for billions of objects with petabytes of capacity. With computing power in each node, performance can keep pace as capacity grows. Indexing of the metadata allows extremely fast filtering and search capabilities. Storage can be carved up into virtual containers based on who owns the data. This is called multi-tenancy. Amazon, Google and many others use this type of storage. Organisations can search across the data and extract what they need, regardless of the originating applications. Now, the data can outlive the infrastructure and the applications which created it, courtesy of the hash checksums. Technology.